Hi everyone, um, my name is Camilo Lopez. I'm here to talk about cloud computing um, in another scale, of course, in the startup scale. Uh, but first, a bit about myself. Um, I'm co-founder and CEO of Adereso Helpdesk, um, a SkyDeck cohort startup. Um, previously, I was CTO and also product owner for a while. Um, I'm part of the Startup Chile Mentors Network. Um, and also before Adereso, I was CTO at Kuluf, a failed social network for pet lovers. And we were part of the Techstars New Year program back in 2013. Um, and I do a degree in computer science and industrial engineering. So why we started Adereso six years ago, uh, the thought at that time was if I have a complaint with brands I use every day, I want to have more options besides calling them by phone. I wanted to use uh, Facebook Messenger or Twitter to chat with companies uh, at my convenience, as I do with my friends and family, and avoid calling at all costs. So with that concept in mind, we build Adereso, which is a help desk for text messaging customer support. We put together WhatsApp, social networks, and automation in one single tool for medium and large companies. Uh, WhatsApp is huge in Latin America, where we currently operate. Um, and today we are a 30 plus uh, people team. We have offices in Chile and Mexico, and we have been bootstrapping so far. That means no private investment. So uh, we started by paying a decent server uh, six years ago, an N1 standard one, uh, one CPU and 3.75 gigabytes of memory. Um, in Google Cloud. Uh, today, that machine costs around 24 bucks a month. Um, and there we put our, our databases and, and a Django application to serve our first customer. Um, that was a Chilean bank. And it took us one year to get the second corporate customer. But that year, we jumped from two clients to 15. So um, from there, we learned a big lesson the concept of single point of failure. Our single machine wasn't up uh, for the job anymore. Uh, we needed to separate our MySQL, MongoDB, and the app in different VMs. So if one component needs more resources, it doesn't affect the others. Um, that's, um, for example, one of the reasons why containers were developed and became a fundamental part of modern software architecture. And this change was really easy because we use cloud services. So um, regarding the, the problem uh, we solve, um, which is get, process, and show uh, many messages and media in real time, uh, it presents four main challenges. So the first one is processing speed. Um, it, um, each message has to be process, processed under 0.5 seconds to feel real time. Uh, the second problem is reliance. Uh, we can't lose any message. Also, we need uh, to provide fast access. Responses in our API uh, must be under 200 milliseconds for the app to feel right. And finally, uh, sequential order consistency. This one is key for artificial intelligence message understanding also for picking the right support agent and getting the support ticket status right. So uh, as Adreso got bigger, the number of agents and messages uh, from social networks, um, um, the eliminations of more single points of failure, uh, faster processing and better performance uh, became more and more difficult. Um, we can, you can parallelize messages from two companies, for example, or two so social networks like Facebook or, or Twitter without major issues. But the messages inside a single conversation must be processed in the right order. And that requires, for example, QE systems. Um, and when we reach over 1 million support tickets, we learn the hard way how indexing in MongoDB works and its limitations making queries with different fields over the same collection. The kind of things that are difficult to grasp when you pick a technology and the business scales and surpasses its original capacity. But being in the cloud makes our life way easier. So cloud computing has been key to be able to start and grow our business. Uh, it allows us to iterate our tech infrastructure 
pivot some ideas, start small and cheap and expand quickly. Um, we are cr currently training a bird based model for nat natural language processing focused in Spanish uh, using uh, cloud TPU from Google. And today we have different microservices with auto scaling clusters, a set of MongoDB instances where each one of them has over, over 40 CPUs and 240 gigabytes of memory. In total, we have around 150 uh, virtual servers with different pr purposes. Uh, we are handling over 80,000 requests per minute, uh, over 1,300 um, customer support agents in six countries. We process, as we, stay, uh, we said uh, at the beginning, uh, over a million plus conversations every day, and we don't own a single physical server. So today we aim to be the Latino software as a service with the most adoption in the world, because we think getting a quick and effective answer when I have a complaint in the social network or app, I, I feel the more comfortable with should be the norm. Thank you. So in the next six months or so at Skydeck, what's your biggest uh, goal? Well, um, one of the first challenges is uh, getting a product differentiation. Uh, we want to go to new markets and we are using some, some status that Latin America give us. For example, uh, when we are one of the few platforms that are in this uh, space, but uh, in other markets it's way more crowded. So we are uh, finding ways to make our product un unique and more appealing, for example, to the US market or Europe. Um, and also we are, are looking to find found our first uh, financial um, investment. Uh, currently we have been bootstrapping so far, as I, I told before. Um, so that means it's, it's just the business, no, no investment so far. 